Chapter 9 They want to live too. I want to see Softy. I want to ask her why she always runs away. I look around. I can't see her in the river. I can't see her near the river. I am very sad. Let's go home, says Mum. We get out of the water and walk home with Mum and Dad. Suddenly, a very small green animal jumps at me. It is very funny. It has got four short legs and two very long and strong legs. It has got very big, funny eyes too. What's this? I ask Dad. It's food, he answers. Very tasty food. Eat it. I look at the animal. It is sitting on my left leg and making a funny noise. I can't eat it. I'm sure it wants to live. Suddenly, I can see a big beak. The beak opens and catches the animal. Oh no! I cry. I can see Dragon. The green animal is inside her beak. What are you doing? I cry. Open your beak. Mm. Answers Dragon. Then I take Dragon by the legs and shake her. Her beak opens and the green animal jumps out. Are you crazy? cries Dragon. I'm fine and you aren't kind, I say. Look, there are a lot of seeds and fruit in the grasslands. Why do you want to eat an animal? Because I like it, says Dragon. No, you don't. When you like somebody, you want to play with her or talk to her. You don't want to eat her. <laughs> Laughs Dragon. Humpty is in love. Dumpty, smiley, listen. Humpty is in love. Who is she? Tell us. Now, I am very angry. I want to hit Dragon, but I can't. She is a girl. Smiley looks at me. She understands me, and she says, I'm in love too. It is so nice to be in love. My brother, Dumpty, looks at us, then at Dragon and says, I'm in love too. That's a pity you are not, Dragon. <laughs>